Languages have become a, a growing concern for business. 75% of the world does not speak English. We are looking at gaining a competitive advantage in selling into those markets. So languages have become a key concern. If we're to look at some of the uh, jobs websites, for example, we'll see that the jobs that are actually advertised are, for, uh, are demanding a language competency. In my time working with, uh, with Enterprise Ireland um, over the last uh, number of years, I really noticed that the language skills deficit is something that's holding back Ireland's progress, particularly our ability to grow uh, the exports of our products and services, which is obviously critical uh, in, at the moment in terms of our future growth opportunities and getting ourselves out of the economic difficulties that we're currently in. I set up my own translation company, Cypherian Translations, six years ago. Uh, we work with multinationals and Irish exporters as they sell into foreign markets. Naturally, if you're selling to the UK or the US, you can use English, but when your customers are French-speaking, German-speaking or Japanese-speaking, then you need to be able to communicate with them or have your brochures or your marketing materials in those different languages. We're an island, and such as an island, our markets are abroad, and indeed uh, the opportunities are, are there for us to access those markets, uh, but we need to obviously uh, make use of other language skills other than English, which we've relied upon perhaps for the USA and the UK markets. And um, that really points the direction in terms of what the, the opportunities that young people should look towards. What we are seeing is that from technology to finance to um, sales, that second language is a real differentiator. And you know, when we see it on a CV, immediately a, a number of opportunities open up that just don't when you don't have it. We see a trend in terms of companies that want to expand beyond Europe um, into the BRIC countries, Brazil, Russia, India and China, and especially for those markets, the language skills are going to be really important. So, you know, I think people can see it in that context that, the, you know, that if you, you really have to have something that makes you stand out from the crowd and all the indications are from the client companies of Enterprise Ireland and from the multinational companies in Ireland that people with languages are getting hired faster, they're commanding salaries 20 to 25 percent higher than people who don't have languages and when, they're, when they get placed in companies they then are extremely valuable assets and they can move quickly through the company and really have a fast track career and get promoted into management in a much shorter time frame than those that don't have languages.